um, here. And then also, um, extra copies of uh, this journal, for any of you who are interested, is published by the American Bar Association, a section on energy, uh, environment, energy, and resources. It's their quarterly journal um, on environmental uh, and related matters. And I have about 10 copies up here for anybody if you want. This particular issue, uh, which came out this fall, is devoted uh, entirely to issues uh, that got r raised by the um, uh, Deepwater Horizon event and raises questions about what should we do about drilling and, and uh, uh, the law and the like. So the um, question today is, do job, do, does, do environmental regulations hurt jobs? So I want to focus initially, before we get into the question of benefits of environmental regulations <coughs> and the environment, uh, on that initial proposition. And I want to suggest that that is an urban myth uh, that has no, uh, no corresponding truth in reality. And that, in fact, environmental relation, regulations not only do not cost jobs, but they are good for the economy. Um, and I'm going to give you a number of examples, as well as explain to you very briefly, sort of theoretically, why that is so, and why the argument that they cost jobs is um, an urban myth. Um, so. Basically, we all know about the free market, and the free market to work efficiently is uh, really needs to have the prices be correct. Uh, and one of the things that the, the prices have to reflect, among other things, are um, the environmental harms that are caused by uh, activities when you engage in uh, environmental engage in activities. And those are real harms in terms of health effects and environmental effects and the like. 